Ja, hallo und herzlich willkommen hier zu meinem kleinen, aber feinen Mini-Let's Play zum Part 2 von, ja, Zurück in die Zukunft, hier mit Michael J. Fox und euren Danny, ich grüße euch. Ja, werden wir mal sehen, was wir heute in dem zweiten Part hier so schönes finden und was wir so alles erleben und wo unser Freund Dr. Dr. Brown ist, ich weiß es nicht, wir müssen mal gucken. I wonder why Doc didn't take any of these with him. Doc, die mitgenommen hat, ich kann euch das nicht sagen. Werden wir mal unserem Vater fragen. Hey, Dad. Wer ist für diesen Verkauf verantwortlich? Who's running this sale anyway? Oh, that'd be me, son. You? Why? Well, once it became apparent that the bank was going through with the sale, I volunteered to oversee it in order to make sure that Doc's stuff would be treated with a modicum of respect. Isn't that right, Biff? You got it, Mr. McFly. Genau, Biff. So sieht's aus. Doc lebt. Was macht Biff hier? What's Biff doing here? He wasn't a friend of Doc's. It's a public sale, Marty. Everyone's allowed. <laughs> Even Biff. Doc lebt. Ist das ein Traum? Ist Do you think ein Traum? can Müsst predict the future? Well, you know I don't go in for that mystical stuff, but I do think they can reflect how you're feeling about the future. What did you dream? Oh, just <coughs> weird stuff yeah, about Doc. Well, that's understandable, don't you think? I guess, but I feel like it was telling me something. Yeah, good. Mal sehen, was wir heute so schön als alles rausfinden hier. Ja, wie gesagt, es ist so angeknüpft an den Film. Ein bisschen an den Film, aber ein bisschen wird ein bisschen neu dazu getextet. Also es macht die Sache sehr interessant. Doc lebt. Ja, das wird ja zumindest gedacht. I'm telling you, this sale is a joke. Doc's only been gone for a few months and I happen to know. Yes, you've told us he's not dead. He's on a trip. Let's say you're right. Have you considered that this trip may not have been entirely voluntary? I hate to say it, but Doc's run up some pretty sizable debts around town. Maybe he's just hiding from his creditors. Ja, vielleicht versteckt er sich bei solchen Gläubigern. Ich glaube, dass wo kaum Doc sitzt, wo irgendwo in der Klemme, wie immer. <lacht> ja, du kennst Doc nicht, meine Rede. You got Doc wrong. Sure, maybe he's not so good with money. That's just because his mind's always on bigger things. But he's still a straight-up guy. He never run away from his problems. Well, you know him better than I do, son. But the bank is within its rights to sell off his stuff. Maybe you should try to find some things to remember him by before Biff grabs them all. Ja, bis Biff sie schnappt, das macht er ja gerne. Irgendwelchen Unsinn und werden wir jetzt mal. I'll keep looking Rausgehen around. Thanks, und Dad. Und uns mal nach neuen Informationen umschauen. Ja, hier haben wir die wunderschöne Stereoanlage, die jeder Mensch der Himmel haben würde. Also ich natürlich eingeschlossen. Let's make some noise. Lass uns mal richtig aufdrehen. Natürlich. Uh. Ja, so haben wir das doch gerne, ne? Geht aber noch ein bisschen was. I better not crank it up anymore. I really don't want to blow this thing out again. Gut, dann lassen wir das jetzt mal so und dann gehen wir mal in den Nachbarraum, wo unser Biff schon wartet oder guckt oder ja. Schauen wir uns doch mal hier ein bisschen um. Kann man dann die Informationen hier nicht wegmachen oder? Ich weiß nicht. Hey Biff. Hi Biff. Oh, hi Marty. Was soll das Ganze hier? Doc lebt noch. What are you doing here? Well, I was as bummed as anybody to hear that the old nutcase had kicked it. He's not. But I'm not above picking through the remains. You know what they say? Don't look a gift horse in the butt. Ja. Bisschen unhöflich, was er macht. Äh. Ja, Doc lebt noch. Doc's not dead, you know. He's still around. Oh, really? Do you see him around here? I'm looking for something uh, in particular. Yeah, something valuable. Uh. 
Nein, natürlich nicht. Ah, uh, never mind. Biff. Das würden wir dir ja nicht sagen. So, was haben wir hier noch schönes? Eine Stereo, eine Musikbox. Hey, let me try, Marty. Now, Biff, let Marty have his turn. You got it, Mr. McFly. Ja, so schnell geht's. Was haben wir hier so schönes? Doc ah. built this model of Downtown Hill Valley way back in 1955. The clock tower in the courthouse even works. The Valley What the? Is that Doc's oh, notebook oh, oh, in there? Oh, 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 oh. That looks just like the courthouse. You gotta hand it to the Fuck. old coot. He was good with his hands. Uh, Biff, uh, can, can I see that a minute? This would look great in my fish tank. Give the old carp something new to nibble on. Welches Aquarium? Uh, dein Aquarium bestimmt nicht. Familienverbindung. Und das Modell schauen. Can I see that model courthouse for just a second? I need to get something out of it. Like what? A not guilty verdict? Oh, falsch, falsch. That was a joke. Oh, ah. but really, can I? No, I think I'll hold on to it. Give it here, Biff. Well, well, look at what we have here. Oh, nein. Looks like plans for something. What's a flux catheter? It's none of your business. Doc asked me Brown's to... Brown's worm food, kid. But this looks like it might be worth something. Ha! Mist. Das war jetzt nicht so ganz geplant, dass Biff hier die Akte von uns bekommt. Oder von Doc. Und, ja, müssen wir sie... Ich denke mal. Hey, Biff. Ist gefährlich. I just can't let you keep that notebook. It's dangerous. What is it set to explode or something? Well, uh, in a way. I'll take my chances. Ja, das Notizbuch ist wertlos. Das glaube ich nicht, dass ihn das interessiert. Ah, das Notizbuch erinnert mich an Doc. Das genau nicht. Ich kaufe es dir ab. Ich würde es dir, würde es dir nicht verstehen. Ja. That notebook wouldn't mean anything to you. You wouldn't even understand what's in it. You calling me ignorant? Gut, dann werden wir uh, jetzt mal never mind. Ob wir ihn vielleicht manipulieren könnten oder sowas. Lass nur das Buch erhalten. Eine Gitarre. Eine Gitarre. Hey Dad, why is my guitar got a price tag on it? Sorry, son. Must have been an overzealous clerk. Just pick it up. I'll iron things out with the bank. Okay. Okay. Gehen wir mal in unser Inventar. Nächstes Objekt. Ja, gehen wir mal. Wir suchen den mal hier an den. Kannst du schießen? Oh ja. Here's an oldie. What a goodie. One, two, three. <laughs> hey, look, it's Chuck Butthead. Ah. Let me show you ah. how it's done. Now, Biff, I think that's Marty's guitar. Oh, <laughs> gosh. <laughs> You're right, Mr. McFly. Here you go, Marty. Let's hear a few licks. Man, you kids have ruined rock and roll. So, das war nicht so ganz geplant. I better not crank it up anymore. I really don't want to blow this thing out again. And now, something your kids are really gonna like. Thanks for warming them up for me, butthead. Biff, I thought I told you not to take my son's guitar. Oh, right. Sure thing, Mr. McFly. I was just warming him up for you, Marty. Let's see what you got. Yeah, it fehlt uns bestimmt noch was hier. Fehlt uns bestimmt noch was. Da müssen wir mal noch mal rumgucken. Man, you kids have ruined rock and roll. Das kann ja sein. Ja, nicht so untypisch. So, dann reden wir doch einfach mal mit unserem alten Herrn. Vielleicht. Hey Dad. Ich 
kann meine Kämpfe selbst austragen. Dad, das klingt schon mal gut. About Biff. Dad, I, I know you're trying to help. He talks a big game, son, but he's not so tough. I've been dealing with him a long time. Believe me, I can handle him. So can I. I guess you can. Okay, son. I'll stay out of your way. You know where to find me. Das klingt schon mal gut, wenn I'll keep looking around. Thanks, Dad. Wenn alter Herr hier raushält, werde ich das noch mal probieren. You want to hear a number by Biff and the Biff Tones? Always happy to play for my adoring fans. Aha. Now watch me blow oh, the shit. lid off this joint. Whatever you say. <laughs> Rock on, Biff. Oh, shit. Das Buch. Ah, Doc, where are you? Sehr schön. Das klang aber wie The DeLorean. Lorien, das ist gut. Wir werden wir mal reingucken. Dark? Where do you come from, boy? Didn't you bring Doc with you? So, then what have we done yet here? So schön is to find, my dear friends. Yeah. Ein Schuh. Okay, Doc, I know I haven't seen you in a few months, but I'm pretty sure this isn't your shoe. Okay. Marty? Ah! Marty, if you're hearing this recording, then the DeLorean's automatic retrieval feature is a resounding success. Automatic retrieval? In case of my failure to return to the DeLorean within an allotted time, I programmed the time machine to jump to these four dimensional coordinates without me. As you are well aware, time travel is an inherently risky activity, and despite my elaborate precautions, there's always the possibility that I could land in trouble sometime. And that sometime is now, or then, or uh, maybe later. He's in trouble. Marty, you come to my rescue in the past, or oh, was it the future? Anyway, I'm relying on you to do it again. Please take the DeLorean back, or, okay. or forward, to whatever it is I'm stuck in time. When you get there, I'm sure you'll figure out what to do. That's it? Aren't you gonna tell me when that is? Just go to the date specified on the time circuit readout under the heading mark Last Time Departed. Good luck. Right, right. Last Time Departed. Last Time Departed. Uh, oh, jeez. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Crap! Oh, great. How am I supposed to find him now? So, meine Lieben, da wollte ich jetzt sagen, war das jetzt der Port 2 und wir werden dann in Port 3 weitersehen, was hier... Phase ist, was das zu bedeuten hat, warum Einstein jetzt auf immer mit der Zeitmaschine da ist und und und. Ja, meine Lieben, ich danke euch. Wenn es euch gefallen hat, lasst doch ein Like da oder ein klein, kleines Abo und ein Kommentar. Das würde mich natürlich auch sehr, sehr freuen. Gut, Dankeschön, bis zum nächsten Mal.